tough nut to... Wigan's three centre-half tactics will make them a tough nut to crack. Add to that the talents of three £100,000... So the first corner of the afternoon, coming in the tenth minute. Guided in towards Jones, a super save, and at the second attempt as well. Jones and Torpy descended on it, but it was Torpy. So, Penny and Mulby hovering over this, very central free kick. Jan Mulby scored one last week. Straight into the middle of the wall. Walker, given away. Here's Greenall. Mulby intercepts. Now Brown. It's a teaser, Torpy! Very, very close. Well... Harmlessly given away and a chance for Jones who meets it on the volley! And that's a terrific finish from Graham Jones. Well, it came out of absolutely nothing. A harmless throw in, an innocuous little ball forward, hesitancy, no offside, and the man in form finds the finish. We can have the lead. Certainly within range of a dangerous ball here, if they can put a bit of pace on it. Straight in at Freestone, they do. And Freestone managed to get a palm to it. The last few seconds of the first half. An awkward one for Freestone. And has the referee given a free kick? I think he has. And the goal, or what they hope is a goal, will not stand. So Swansea City forced to make a change at the start of the second half. The player manager succumbing to the uh, injury uh, problems that he's had. And Kwame Ampardu, who also was not 100% fit, is also out onto the field. And Swansea nearly giving away a penalty in those opening exchanges. Martinez upended, but neat. Penny fighting back, winning the ball. Jones. Walker, Jones again, good skills, not a bad cross either, Edwards is in there, on the side of the bar, Torpy, it's 1-1. It was almost slow motion there, no one seemed to be marking, it was static, Edwards header beat Butler. Greenall takes a free kick towards Jones, reaches Martinez, flicked away by Penny. Now Thomas, given away. Dangerous position as well, Martinez for Wigan. Lovely ball. Now David Lowe. It's a good ball, Jones! His second of the contest. And Graham Jones puts Wigan back in front. Again, question marks against the Swansea City defence here. They're very static, and the only man to react inside the six-yard area is Graham Jones with a header. Claude to take it, very close to the goalkeeper. Oh, it's an own goal! I think it was off the back of Pender. Torpy was near to it. It was slammed in by Claude. Both defender and forward went to it, and I think that's an own goal. Free kick again. It was his free kick that gave Swansea their equaliser, and now they're looking for a winner. Coates in the middle. Good save by Butler. Lovely one-two. Coates riding his luck, going forward just too far in front of him, and Butler smothered well. Backwards by Kilford, does well though, and Martinez is in, in the clear. Low.
Good run by Johnson. Now Sharp. Lovely cross low. Oh, he's hit the inside of the post. Out to Kilford. Now Jones. Kilford again. 3 2. What a game this has turned out to be now. The first effort from Lowe smacked off the inside of the post. And as Swansea appeared to have rode their luck, it came out to Kilford and killed. Kick taken quickly. Here's Lowe. Measured cross. Jones didn't get there. Back in by Kilford. Flicked over the Omar by Edwards. Yes, I'm just a little bit glad that they had a dodgy start or I think they'd have run away with it by now. Um, on comparison with Fulham and Carlisle, they're probably as good, if not better. And, um, you know, I think possibly the one good decision I made first half was to man mark Jan Moll because um, if he'd have been allowed to have rain, he'd have picked out them three very strong and uh, pacey front runners he's got. So, in other words, finishing counted for a lot for you today, didn't it? Yeah, I think from both teams. Um, my strike, uh, I can't say enough about him, really. Uh, I'm going to hang on to him as long as I possibly can, but uh, there's no doubt that he's got the capacity in every department to play at the very highest level of this game. And um, he's come out and on league. He's scoring goals on a regular basis. Uh, we did a little bit of work with him during the week, and we have done about pulling away from defenders, and that's where his second goals come from. And uh, he's like an empty vessel at the moment to be filled up, and he's filling up quickly.